infiltration of water through soil. Aim to study infiltration of water through soil. Materials required A used plastic bottle Soil Water A piece of cotton cloth Knife Procedure Take a clean used plastic bottle Cut the bottle with a knife about 5 cm below the neck to divide it into two parts. Invert the upper part of the bottle and keep it over the lower part. The upper part will be used as a funnel and the lower part as a container. Place a piece of cloth in the improvised funnel. Now add some soil over the cloth till it fills two-third part of the funnel. Your apparatus to show infiltration is ready. Pour some water on the soil and wait for some time. Check if some water drops are trickling down. If not, pour some more water on the soil surface till water starts trickling down. Observations we can see that the water which was poured over the soil has percolated through the soil and a part of it gets collected in the container. You can also try to do the experiment using different types of soil and observe the change. The speed at which water flows through the soil depends on the particle size of the soil sample. Sand has particles of larger size, hence there are pores in between for the water to flow through. On the other hand, the clay has very fine particles and less pores. That is, percolation rate of water is different in different types of soil. It is highest in the sandy soil and least in the clay soil. Conclusions Surface water from any source, that is, water bodies, rain, or that from human activities, percolate through soil and get stored as groundwater. This process of seeping of water into the ground is called infiltration.